But today's going to be a quiet weather day, but we do have some changes heading into Tuesday with a threat for showers and storms, but also the threat for a few severe storms too. All day tomorrow from uh, the time the sun comes up, winds are going to be very gusty. We'll likely have sustained winds probably between 15 and 25 miles an hour with winds gusting up to 35 miles an hour, and that's going to be outside of any thunderstorms and certainly outside of any severe weather as well. The majority of the showers and storms that we do see at least the stronger ones will come during the afternoon hours through the evening and a few scattered severe are possible, especially in West Alabama. And you can see our risk level has increased, especially for the western half of the state. And so now much of this area is under a slight risk for a few severe thunderstorms. I really do think the main time frame will be shortly after lunchtime through about nine o'clock with those storms moving into Georgia by then. But all modes of severe weather are possible. So damaging winds I think will be the primary hazard up to about 60 miles an hour, but isolated tornadoes can't be ruled out either, especially as you come further west as we think instability values will likely be a little bit higher here, but also some quarter size hail possible too. So let's start you off on the future cast. This is 7 a.m. tomorrow morning, and I do think there could be a few showers around during the first half of the day tomorrow. So I don't think the morning hours will be totally dry. And then you'll notice a line of thunderstorms and moving close to the Alabama border as we get near lunchtime and then kind of moving into our western county. So Haleyville, Hackleburg, Aliceville, uh, maybe between noon and two or three three o'clock and then between about three and perhaps seven o'clock for the I-65 corridor. And then you'll notice the line does show some weakening as it shifts into East Alabama. Uh, perhaps ingredients for severe storms not quite as likely here in the eastern counties, but there could still be a, a strong wind gust or two there. So something that uh, we'll be watching through the afternoon and and you need to be on alert as well. So impact weather tomorrow with showers and thunderstorms expected 40s and 50s to start the day now. So it is a little bit cool in spots. Once the front comes through tomorrow, we do drop off. We cool uh, down into the 60s, some 40s by Thursday morning. Rick, thanks, Steph. Uh, a 4:40. Uh,